Hey, what's up? This is Chosen, and this video is going to be designed to help you learn how to make those tough decisions when it comes to re-rolling gear when you don't know exactly what's best or there's two stats that are pretty similar and you're trying to decide how to re-roll your gear. This is going to be designed to teach you how to determine which is better for you, so let's get into it. Okay, so I'm up here at the Mystic, and I've got my Demon Hunter T13 Farmer here with the gold wrap multi-shot build, and I've got this helm here. That's nothing special, but it's it's pretty decent. It's got the main stat, the vitality, and then I have a choice for that my third option on what I want on there. Now, when I go to re-roll this, do I want 6 crit, or do I want to go for 15% multi-shot damage to help my main damage dealing skill? How do I know which one's better? Do you know? Do you have a guess? Is it 6 crit, or is it 15% multi-shot for a Paragon 816 character with 57% crit chance and 396% crit damage, which one is better in that situation? So make your guess and then I'll go calculate it and we'll figure it out. Okay, I'm going to walk you through this step by step as if you're starting at home from step one. You're going to open up a web browser and you're probably going to see something like this. So we just go up to our address bar. We type in d3planner.com. And you'll be presented with a screen like this. Now, I have an account made in this website, but you, I don't even think you need to make an account. I think you can just do all this without an account. So if you want to, make an account. If not, I think that's fine. First thing we want to do is go to import slash save. We're going to type in our battle tag, and we're going to be listed, the heroes that we have on our account. And now, the one that I was curious about is my seasonal multi-shot demon hunter. And then it's going to show me a Paragon distribution tab, and all the gear that I had on that character. Now, this is a very important step to fill out your Paragon. If I remember right, I was Paragon 816. So we type that in, we hit enter, it automatically fills in these ones. If it, if it doesn't, just put them in correctly. And then my boots are 11% um, movement speed, so I would have 14 movement speed in here. Or I mean, uh, oh, I, I only get half a point, so I would have... 28 I would want 14% movement speed to make that 25 so I know that's how it goes and then we'll just put 50 points here because that's the max and then it says I have 138 unspent so I would put in the 138 and now my character has the paragon and the gear that I have in game the reason it's important to get the paragon to be accurate is because the calculations will change based on your crit chance or crit damage and, and all these kind of stats and your main stat can affect it. So you want to get these accurate so you're getting the correct representation of what you have in game versus what this program is going to show you. So now we're going to go over to equipment and we are going to select that helm and we see that currently we have six crit and we're wondering would it be better to get 15% multi-shot on there. So what I like to do is switch this skill on the bottom right to multi-shot DPS. Because that's what I'm kind of most concerned about is what's the DPS of my main damage dealer. And you can do all sorts of stuff with this, with this website. You can do all sorts of testing and customization. I'm just showing you this one way that I use to calculate which is a better role. So multi-shot DPS. Now, right now, it's representing this number as what my helm is with 6% crit. So we got 68,195. Let's switch this 6 crit to multi-shot damage. And it went from 68,195 up to 70,688. So actually, it's showing that the multi-shot is the better decision there. So just to confirm it, let's test it again. We go from 76.88 to crit chance, and it went down a little bit. Yep, from 76.88 to 68.195. So just to make sure we're right, we'll make sure that it goes up again. And yes, it went up a little bit. So it's close, but it looks like the multi-shot is better. And you can actually go over to this simulate tab, and you can simulate even further to figure out which one is better. So what I can do is just add multi-shot and you can do all sorts of things like you can add all of your skills and set it up to rotate through all of your abilities to get like a more accurate representation but let's just do this the simple way let's just put in multi-shot and then we go down here to simulate 
my average distance is probably about 25 yards when I'm fighting. And target options, we're going to want our averages. We're probably hitting, you know, a few whites and like an elite pack. And then the spread, they're never like standing clumped up on one tile. They are spread out a little bit. You know, let's spread them out over the course of like 20 yards. Like let's say there's a 20 yard radius that has these mobs in there. And then we uh, we hit start. And this is what it gives us. 269 billion damage that we did in this kind of simulated scenario. So now that's with the 15% multi-shot. Let's switch this over to 6 crit. And see what we get. Where's our 6 crit? Crit damage, 6. Go back over to simulate. And let's see where it goes from 269. Goes down to 260. So that's kind of two different tests that have shown me that the optimal damage roll for my helm, if I'm focusing on doing the most multi-shot DPS I can, is probably to go with the 15% multi-shot damage. So now we go back in game, we go to our mystic and we're like, okay, I have six crit, but it's telling me that having multi-shot damage is a little bit better. So why not throw that on there and we'll, and we'll try it out and see if we like that better because according and we actually got lucky and got multi-shot 15. So look at that. So there you go. Now I, you know, showed you how to kind of calculate how to make those decisions. And now my demon hunter that's farming T13 should be doing just a little bit more damage and be a little bit more optimi optimized. Alrighty, that's going to do it for what I wanted to show in this video. If you have any questions, make sure and let me know down in the comments. I'll do my best to help you out. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Peace.